So we're on to the 157-pound match between freshman Brandon Gallagher from Gettysburg and sophomore Chris Kummer from Elizabethtown. Smith's pin officially goes down as 349. Makes the team score now 11 to 6 in favor of the Bullets. This is Gallagher's collegiate debut. He did not wrestle over the weekend. Comer went 3 and 1 with a tech fall at the Messiah Invitational. Finished runner up at 157. Comer from Hamburg, Pennsylvania. Gallagher from Stewartsville, New Jersey. Brandon's older brother, Orion, is a senior on the Gettysburg College football team. There's a warning on the E-Town grappler. Comer dives in, grabs the freshman's leg. Gallagher locks in, trying to prevent the takedown. Has a hold of Comer's foot there. Gallagher needs to get his leg out of there. Comer has a vice grip on it, though. This is going to go down as a stalemate it, within a few seconds, I would guess. Comer is still working, moving up Gallagher's legs. And wow, nice move by the E-Town grappler. Surprised that went as long as it did, but Comer was working the whole time. Gallagher was just trying to prevent any kind of movement. Gallagher stands up, back to one knee for the bullet freshman. 30 seconds left in the first period. Comer leading two to nothing. Comer has Gallagher's arm pinned, rolls over. Gallagher in a near fall situation. Rolls out before the official could count past two. So that will go down as a near fall two. And two more, to, two more points will be on the board for the Elizabethtown grappler. Comer now leads four to nothing. So Comer defers and Gallagher will pick the down position. It's like a caution on Gallagher. Gallagher trying to stand up. Comer with a nice hold on Gallagher's left foot to keep him from getting up. Gallagher stands up. Comer on his back trying to flip the E-Town grappler over. Gallagher works the head and shoulders and gets Gallagher back down to the ground. Really an exhausting position for a wrestler to be in. Trying to get out of the down position. The referee will call a stalemate. Resume position back in the center of the mat. Gallagher will go down. Kamura on top. The East Sound Grappler with a minute 51 of riding time right now. 108 left in the second period. And another caution on the Gettysburg Grappler.
Gallagher quickly stands up. Comer brings him right back down. Comer swings back to the right, rolls Gallagher over. Gallagher able to roll with it, but back over. Reverse momentum there for Comerer. He'll get at least a near fall four on this. Four more points for the E-Town grappler. He now leads eight to nothing. Nearly three minutes of riding time. Well, 10 seconds left in the second period. Gallagher certainly doesn't want to give up a pin. Those points add up fast in matches like that. this, which are seem to be very close so far. So the Elizabethtown grappler will take the down position. Gallagher will work on top. Gallagher a bit high on that mount. Comer working his way out. Gallagher slipping off the left side now. Trying to get back on top. And he manages to almost flatten Comer out. Good position to work from for back points. Comer able to get back on his hands and knees. Trying to work his legs out. Gallagher is too high in that position. Comer is going to slip out from behind if the freshman's not careful. Comer is almost out here. Gallagher just trying to hold on to his arm now, and the East Town Grappler is out. The reversal for two points. And there's a warning on Gallagher. Trails 10 to nothing right now. Comer very close to clinching the riding time point. He has clinched the riding time point, actually. So he's got at least a major decision here. If he could get a 15-point advantage, he would get a technical fall, and just like that, we'd have a tied score in the team scoring. 30 seconds left. It's another warning on Gallagher, and that'll be a penalty point. Comer now leads 11 to nothing. Just 10 seconds left. Comer trying to roll Gallagher over. And nothing doing there. And it looks like this one's going to end with a 12 to nothing major decision. 